High Nevada Virtual Academy, um, Algebra, Proficiency Exam, High School, Middle School, Elementary School, you name it. Let's do one more problem here. Um, problem number 193, what is the y-intercept of the line 2x minus 3y, right? Once again, quick review, x, y, if you have a line, okay, with a you know, linear equation here, y-intercept will be the point where your line is crossing the y-axis, and usually that point is b because, uh, you know, in the slope-intercept form, you have the equation y equals mx plus b, m would be your slope, b is your y-intercept, okay, so that's the point, y-intercept, that point will have the coordinate 0 and we set b, okay, because x will be 0, this is the origin, obviously, for this point on the y-axis, x will be 0. Well, if x is 0, that's what you have to do. Well, x equals 0, right, for the y-intercept. Plug it in. You're going to plug in, so you'll have, what, 2 times 0 minus 3y equals 12. Well, that's 0. You can ignore it. Divide everything else by negative 3. Negative 3 divided by negative 3 is 1. y equals positive divided by negative is always negative. 12 divided by negative 3 is going to be negative 4. So your point will have the coordinates x0, y, negative 4. Okay. And your line obviously has to cross your y-axis somewhere here. But it's not relevant for the problem. 0, negative 4. The answer, the right answer, seems to be A. We're moving on to another problem. Okay, another one. Let's see what do we have in here. Which inequality represents the solution of parentheses 11x plus 2, close the parentheses, plus parentheses 6x plus 4, close the parentheses, plus in parentheses x plus 5, close the parentheses greater than 9. And some of you will say, oh my god, this is a hard problem, which is not. As you notice, there is always a plus sign in front of every parenthesis, which means you can rewrite the whole thing without any parenthesis. Your equation, your inequality actually, will be 11x plus 2 plus 6x plus 4 plus x plus 5 greater than 90, right? Combine your like terms, 11x plus 6x plus x is going to be 17x plus x, 18x. Combine your free terms, 2 plus 4 is 6, plus 5 is going to be plus 11, greater than 90. Separate your variable, leave your 18x by itself, right? Subtract 11 from both sides. 18x, 11 minus 11 cancels out. Bring down the inequality sign that is not changing at all. 11 out of 90 is going to be 79, right? What should we do next? Next thing, divide by 18, because that's your x's coefficient. Divide by 18, both sides. 18, 18, x. Once again, inequality sign is not changing. 17 over 18, I mean 79 over 18. You can leave it that way, because that's the way it's given to you. And this is how you find that A, again, is the answer. Okay? Well, this is it. Let's stop now. I will be back with another one.